Yeah, definitely not. Time to go to bed. Josh Shant, Michael Hammond and David Ford will lead us away for 15 laps. Oh, it's 20 laps, sorry. 20 laps for our feature race. And eight cars out on track. Damon Thompson, Cody Abrams, Jake Williams, Ryan Penfold, Scott, oh, sorry. Mark Higgins and Justin Malnews for 20 laps. So sit in, relax. This is going to be an absolute barn burn around in front anyway. So our six cars that were in the pole shuffle have already separated themselves from Higgins. And Justin Malnews for lap number one goes the way of Michael Hammond. He'll be loving the fact he was able to not miss the gear this time around, but he's been kept true at the moment by David Fall and Damon Thompson as well. So two collie drivers of Thompson and Avens are right behind. Our two drivers trying to take away the Collie Club Championship from our locals. Feels like a line of stern sort of event for the top four, but it's been set at a rapid rate of knots. And a pace that it might be sort of wary for David Fall if he can hang on for the entire 20 distance. And maybe he can because he tries to the inside. Drag race to the line on lap number three. It's going to be still Michael Hammond. Hammond had the outside line, but is he too wide this time around? Yes, he has as the Timber Town Titan of David Fall has hit the front. Trying the switcheroo goes Michael Hammond. We have to the outside, didn't like it. Maybe the inside lines, he digs to the bottom. Another drag race to the line. It's still full that holds on that time around. Be hoping for a restart now as he holds on to the front at the moment. And maybe not the line that he wants to as well because that was very loose out of turn number four. He just couldn't get the traction down and it does allow Michael Hammond to cruise down to the bottom. Has he got enough in the tank? Does Hammond this time around? No, he doesn't. It's still David Ball out in front. But now look who's coming to join. The man we call Red Jesus. He saw the outside line work for Michael Hammond for those extra couple of laps. He sees that David Fall is able to keep the seven car true. But now that Fall has been able to get a gap as Justin Malnus has gone off the track, he now goes a lap down in car number 51. It's Fall back then to Hammond and Damon Thompson. Hammond really wants to have enough points where he doesn't have to go to Albany, but if he continues to fall back through the field with double points, it could be a trip to Albany on the 6th and 7th of January for the man we call the Hammer, Michael Hammond. Second place is still that of Damon Thompson. Back there is Cody Avers as they're going back a line of stir. And David Fall is just a lot enjoying the fact that he's leaving the door open enough for Michael Hammond to snap. The top side has been falls the whole time around, this time with eight completed. It's an absolute lung bust around in front. They've been able to disperse of Thompson and Avens this time around, which means they've got enough breathing room where they can attack each other right now. So we'll give you the running order with 10 laps down and 10 to go in your street stock feature race. Your leader is David Fall. Second place is Michael Hammond. He's so close there as well. It's a car length in between them. Third place is still Damon Thompson and Cody Avids. Back then, it's Ryan Penfold and Jake Williams. We'll forget about that one as well because they're side by side for the race lead. In fact, it's only Mark Higgins and Justin Malnews at the back of the field. Eight cars still remaining in this one as David Fall was all out of shape out of turn number four. He just continues to allow Michael Hammond to have that bottom line. He hasn't been able to shake him in the last three laps. And Michael Hammond hasn't had enough yet to pull the trigger and get past him. And now it's a three-way battle for the race lead because here comes Red Jesus. Jesus has got the top shelf on this one. Has he got the better on Michael Hammond this time around? Full does by two car legs. And this is when it gets juicy. Here comes the lap competitors to play. The first of those ones will be Justin Malnews. Cody Avens is still in this one as well. It's anyone's race at the moment. What an absolute bad burner this one is. Full sideways right in front of Michael Hammond. So they've all decided now it's time to hit the bottom side of the racetrack. Probably at the wrong time as well. It may have looked like they tried to use Malnoosh as a pick. It has helped for Full anyway. He's got two car lengths again on it this time. Second place is Michael Hammond. Then it's back 
backed into third, Damon Thompson. And for some reason as well, we haven't forgot about Cody Avids. He's still sniffing there. The EL Falcon just waiting for a chance. Another good battle going on for fifth place as well. Between that of Jake Williams and the 12 of Ryan Penfold. What an absolute fire this event is. He's had enough of the bottom now. It's time to go to the top shelf. Bit of a, of a role reversal between David Fall and Michael Hammond. Fall's decided, time to run the... Oh, Fall! Hammond around! Yellows! Wow! And Michael Hammond. Fall's decided, time to run the... Oh, Fall! Hammond around! Yellows! Wow! And Michael Hammond. Fall's decided, time to run the... Oh, Fall! Hammond around! Yellows! Wow! On Michael Hammond's car, we wait to see what turn he makes. He's going to turn back onto the track. He's going to keep on rolling the crowd cheers. And right now, this gets juicy. It doesn't look like there's anything broken. That's a positive. And David Fall has been sent to the rear of the field. So your new leader now is Michael Hammond. Damon Thompson. Cody Avens, Jake Williams, Ryan Penfold, your top five. Seven laps to go. In your street stock Collie Club Championship, we're back underway. Oh, it's a bit of an anticlimactic sort of feel. Right now with Hammond back out in front. But will the car, if he feels any sort of damage, Last the next seven laps, David Fall is trying everything to get back into the points of this one. He's already got past Mark Higgins. Hammond starts to sail into the sunset. David Fall trying everything on the top shelf. He rattles around the outside of Ryan Penfold as here comes Cody Avens now for the bridesmaid spot. Damon Thompson has to be relegated back to P number three. David Fall trying the switcheroo as he looks to the inside of Jake Williams for fourth place. Avens holding on for grim death at the moment. For position number two as we run across the line this time by. And there'll be five laps remaining of the street stock final. The race is for second place. It's just like that race for P number one earlier on. Just incorporating now Jake Williams. Williams and Fall were side by side for all of about 15 metres as David Fall is just slicing his way back through the field. Around the outside of Damon Thompson, he goes, and Fall is back to position number three. Laps definitely not ticking by his way, though. As him and Cody Avens are separated by half the straight as Ryan Penfold has a big excursion on the infield in this one. As we said, a very anticlimactic finish to this one with two laps to go. Can Avens hold on for the runner-up position? David Fall will put on a monumental task if he can finish with a bridesmaid position. Still to get back to third place has been a phenomenal job, but one more wouldn't hurt as the white flag comes out. Michael Hammond. The class of the field of the street stocks yet again. In a weekend, it's been all about him, but we'll keep our eyes on second place. Michael, Michael Hammond will be the Collie Club champion. The decision is going to be who is going to be second place, and it's Cody Avens. Cody Avens will come home in second from fall. Then it's Damon Thompson, Jake Williams, Ryan Penfold, Mark Higgins, and Justin Melnoosh. Probably not the finish we were hoping for, but how about that, Collie? Still an entertaining one for our street stocks. Your winner.
Ikjan number seven is Michael Hammond. That's what we want to see, Collie. Come on, when he comes around, flash your lights, toot your horns, make some noise for your Collie Club champion, Michael Hammond. 